Okay, in this question, we are going to look at a grasshopper. Okay, and uh, this grasshopper, the mass is 0 0.12 gram, jumps vertically. It uses the large back legs over a time of 0 0.02 seconds to jump. Wow, you are testing me every day, Cambridge. How do I draw a grasshopper? My grasshopper is going to look like a cockroach. But it has large back legs. So this is my grass grasshopper. And it leaves the ground at a velocity of 3 meter per second. What is the average power developed by the legs of the grasshopper? Okay, so the... Whenever you want to jump, okay, let's imagine, okay, like if you've been sitting down the whole day, you can stand up and try to jump. When you want to jump, right, normally you will lower your body a bit to load your muscles, your quads, your glutes, your hamstring. You will lower down your body a bit so that your muscle actually retracts and store potential energy. That potential energy will convert to kinetic energy. That's why you can jump. Okay, so right now, the same thing will happen to our tiny little Jiminy Cricket grasshopper. When he when it bends the back leg, there will be potential energy stored within the muscles. ATP, yeah. those who do bio want some ATP, ATP magic is happening. So that energy is converted to Ke. So whenever I'm looking for power, as mentioned, I either look for a change in energy or I look for FV. And in this case, FV is a no-go because this V is not constant. Miss, how you know it's not constant? Look, I don't care what magical grasshopper you are. You leave the ground at 3 meter per second. Gravity will say your speed is going to decrease. Okay. okay. So he bends his leg and he lifts off, lifts, lift off in 0 0.020 seconds. Okay, so change in energy over time. Not constant, cannot use. P equal to FV, not constant, cannot use. P equal to change in energy over time, can use. Okay, so change in kinetic energy over time. So the increase in kinetic energy is actually half mv square over T. We can substitute the mass 0 0.12 gram, need to convert to kg. Okay, the speed is 3 square divided by 0 0.020. That's it for my Jiminy Cricket, the grasshopper. So let me press my calculator. And this one shows me that my good friend has 2.7 times 10 to the power of negative 2 watt. 1, 2, yes answer is C. Okay, so always when you look for power, you have two routes one. Only use this when you know that the velocity is constant. I know for a fact, because I jump enough in this life, to know that if I leave the ground at a certain speed, there's zero chance that I can maintain that speed because there's gravity pulling me down. Okay, so the back leg will convert the energy stored in the muscle, <laughs> muscle or whatever structure there is in the grasshopper and convert it to Ke. Another clue that we're talking about KE is because they only mention velocity. So you can, sometimes if you don't understand the physics, you can just like, okay, what are the energy that involves velocity? Also can, because sometimes it's just to answer the question, but hopefully you will also take time to think about the physics.